shoot the ball, I think, a little quicker than we wanted to. Um, but you have to credit Chico for having played outstanding defense. You know, this is a very tough rivalry you guys have, you know, from last year's Sweet 16 matchup. What can you take from this game and apply it to the next time you guys face Chico at their home? Well, it'll be next Saturday night. And, you know, we'll take the tape and look at it and see what uh, where we can make some improvements on. I don't think we're, we're that far away. You know, they shot 40% from the field. We shot 34%. They shot uh, in the 40, 23, and we were right there. So I think it's just a matter of a couple of turnovers. We had you know, 14 turnovers, which is a little much in a game that's low scoring like that. But uh, we'll, we'll evaluate the tape and, and see what we can do to uh, do the change things. But it's going to be a pretty quick turnaround. And like I was telling the paper reporter, um, we hopefully will face these guys three, maybe four times now from here on out. And it's, it's the one that wins that last one that, that makes a difference. Uh, the injury on Tyler Barber, how does that affect the team uh, morale, the, uh, the skills that he brings to the core every night? What can you do if it's a long term injury? How can you guys uh, replace him? How can you guys, what, can you guys, what could you guys do to, you know, have him have like that impact? Well, I think uh, you know, Ty was just coming around and feeling pretty comfortable out there and shooting the ball well for us. And it would be unfortunate if he can't go by next Saturday. But, you know, we have uh, seniors and juniors, Clint, uh, Chanel, and has to give us a little more, and Alex Carlson has to give us something. And I think between those two guys, uh, they can pick up the role. If they get minutes and get comfortable, then they'll, uh, I think, be able to shoot the ball with some consistency. Uh, they're just not getting the enough minutes right now to feel comfortable about it. And, and finally, the officiating tonight, what can you guys do to cut down on fouls? What, what, how is the officiating? What was your thought about the officiating tonight? Well, um, you know, Chico was, plays a very physical type game, and hey, we, we just have to match that. You know, we can't, uh, can't ask the officials to do anything else to manage the game. And you know, sometimes the call goes your way, sometimes it doesn't. And you just have to live with it and, and uh, try to try to make it up, and, uh, especially at the defense end, because you, that's something you can control using that game right out, not so much offense. All right, thank you, Coach. Appreciate it. Good luck in your next game.